on this is Jack and welcome back to another Minecraft video and welcome back to the Minecraft Let's Play. So last video we made a tunnel that will be leading us to the slime uh, swamp portal and uh, now we can travel there pretty easily but uh, this, this project has not been done I have to actually do the decorations and uh, I have a pretty good design that will really really suit the nether and uh, it's right here so this is the design I'm going to be going for and uh, this is going to be the wall and we're gonna have our eyes and this is going to be on both of these sides so it's gonna be extending as far as it, it can so this is how it's going to be looking from inside and I think it looks pretty good and we're gonna have the roof with the slab so as we can see the design really needs a lot of nether bricks so uh, what I've been doing is smelting a lot of these nether bricks and uh, we are getting a lot of these bricks so firstly we will need a lot and lots of stairs so we're gonna craft those and uh, we will need a lot of slabs and uh, for the design we also need a lot of glowstone now I do have a lot of glowstone in my chest but it is not going to be enough so I will have to go on a search for more alright so a lot of progress has been done and I am sorry if you can hear that really a nice sound so um, I, I have found an alternative alternative to this glowstone we have um, the magma block so what you can do is just to place the magma block next to a block and the magma block will have the properties that this block has so now if I remove these it's going to be pretty dark here but if I just break this and place this one it's not going to be dark because uh, it, it is not absorbing any light and now it's very really dark so th this way we can actually make a lot of things like this I just have to place down glowstone and then break it and these two blocks will forever give off light alright so a lot of progress has been done we are almost there that's the end and that's the other end and I am currently adding the stairs to these lights and uh, these lights are looking really really nice and I think it was a right decision to change the glowstone to these uh, whatever these are magma blocks and uh, yeah so what I'm gonna do is complete off this tunnel and I'll be back oh my god I have been such an idiot this whole episode I could have gotten all the netherrack from this I have been smelting this netherrack one hour work every time and it's been like seven hours and I have only done this this could have been so much easier now I have a lot of these because I dismantled one of these pillars so that's 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 just amazing alright guys so the road has been done and now is going to be the first test drive of this thing and there we go you can see it's amazing it's looking so good okay alright and we're back here so on the back over here we're, we have added some of this glass so I can see outside and it looks really really good I, I really want to spend a lot of time over here and I will have a door over here so for now we just have like another rack or two so yeah we're going to be adding a iron door probably and uh, we have the nether fortress and I still can't believe that I didn't thought of getting the nether brick from the fortress before like seriously so I'm, I'm really really mad at that but uh, at least the thing has been done so what I have done is mended my pickaxe and my sword so now we have a fully repaired pretty nice looking pickaxe alright guys so what we're going to be doing is improving this little turn over here which will lead us to the actual ice road over itself so what I'm gonna do is uh, make this look a little bit better because for now we have a pretty boring little tunnel and uh, the fact that it, it has no decoration makes it seem a lot more longer so we we're going to be adding a few of these blocks and making it look good alright so the tunnel has been completed almost I just am in the process of placing down the glowstone breaking it and placing glass so we are again using the magma block and uh, a little bit of stone break action and it's looking pretty good and uh, 
now it looks like an actual tunnel so when the lights are in there will be no pigment here and it's going to be a lot more like uh, a peaceful tunnel than just a mob farm alright so here it is what I did is added a little bit of stair over here and I think that it is looking just amazing so we have our light over here we have our insane looking blocks and it's looking really really good and it's upside down over here and it's upside whatever that is I, this one is down over here this one is up so it's kind of like a opposite wall not really I don't know what I'm saying but uh, it's looking pretty good it is amazing so what I'm gonna do is actually add a piston door over here or a normal door so the pigman don't enter over here and I don't have to worry about swinging my hands like this so yeah alright and here it is this is a pretty average door I know but it, it works it is going to be working for me the only problem here is that the pigman still can enter because I am using pressure plates I don't really know if there's a better way to use this door other than have pressure plates but I'm not going to be adding them more because my armor is not looking very good so yeah and uh, yeah that is the whole tunnel done now I don't really think that there is uh, anything more to do than this I know that there are like pretty fancy contraptions that will like pick up the boat automatically it will break and pick up the boat and dispense the boat as well but uh, I don't really know that I want that here because it, it's it's a pretty average build it's not the prettiest and it's not the best so yeah we're not going to be doing that and it's only too wide so it's not going to be working out anyway so this is the fortress we are going to be exploring this place uh, later in any ep some episodes but uh, for now that was the end of today's episode I hope you enjoyed this video and if you did then be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more videos and I'll see you in the next one thanks for watching and goodbye.